Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Aaron. I play goalie in a roller hockey beer league. And in this game, it's going to be the orange team versus the blue team. Um, for the most part, I've been playing for the orange team this season. Um, I've kind of been more of a sub than anything, but when I have played, I have been playing for the orange team. So we have a little bit of a connection, if you will. Um, so enjoy the video. Let me know what you guys think and I'll see you at the end. That goal was a really bad bounce and it was just really hard to control that one. All right, one, one. That one went right between my legs in the five hole. That shot right there, however, that was the save of the night for me because big glove save, and you hear Glenn, the ref, say that right now. Big glove save. Yeah. But then follow that up, they score on a rebound, so it's kind of anticlimactic. That shot just beat me clean on the glove side, and that's something that I really need to work on, is getting better at catching and, and tracking the puck into my glove. All right, so this is the second half right here, and you might notice that there's a, a really shadowy strip of the court in front of me, and that's because some of the overhead lights weren't working, but fortunately it didn't really affect my ability to see the puck. These rebounds are killing me, and this game's really starting to get away from me at this point. So on that goal right there, I mean, obviously it was a breakaway, one-on-one, -on -one, me against the shooter, and with that, I mean, there's only so much that I can do. 
but I still need to take responsibility for those goals and it's up to me to block them. I went down too early and I should have been more patient and stayed up to block the shot. And that other goal just beat me clean on the blocker side. The blue team is definitely passing the puck a lot and it's just I need to get better movement from left to right, right to left in order to be able to um, move from one side of the net to the other. Unfortunately because of the friction involved in roller hockey it's a lot harder than it would be in ice hockey. So here we get a, a power play for two minutes and really do a whole lot with it unfortunately right there you see my stick go out in front of me I just kind of let it go because the the puck hit the crossbar behind me and I knew that it bounced back so I wanted to be able to have both of my hands in order to be able to hold on to the puck there at the end and then that last goal terrible because they scored right before the buzzer so just kind of insult the injury honestly this whole game was really frustrating i did really well in the second or in the first half but then the second half it just went downhill and just after watching this um just some things that i'm noting that i definitely need to work on um is continuing to work on tracking the puck better and um uh, being able to catch with my my glove and then get from one side of the net to the other side of the net and cut down the angles. Just be bigger and um, obviously as the more shots that come in and the more goals they score, your confidence goes down. So just keeping my emotions intact during games like this. So at the end of the day, I could blame the game on defense, I could blame it on that one strip of lights being out, but really, um, it's I'm the goalie. It's my job to block shots, and I just did not do that in this game. Um, definitely could have played better, could have tracked the pucks better, but like I said, um, it's all just part of the learning process, and hopefully um, in the next one I will be better. Um, next week starts the playoffs. Not sure which team I'm going to be playing for or if I'm going to be playing at all. But hopefully um, I'll see you guys all next week. So until then, have a great week. I'll talk to you then.